it's scary. It's a funny scary. <laughs> that is the biggest rabbit I've ever seen. <laughs> I thought it was a deer in a cage when we were in your yard. Oh my god, the thing will rip your arm off. Night of the lupus. The general from uh, Watership Down. Yeah. Like for a little scale. There's a little bunny. Giant bunny shying away. All right, man. See you later, big bunny. All right, so here I am with uh, my brother Dan's with me today. We're going. Uh, we're gonna go into the Monsignor. Oh, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. You serious? What? Let's put those damn glasses. What do you mean? They're awful. What's wrong with them? All right, all right go, go, go. Yeah, what's wrong with the glasses? <laughs> ridiculous. What's ridiculous about them? They're red. What's wrong with red? Red is awful. You can't wear those. They're different. Let's do this again. No. <laughs> you can't wear those. This is. What's wrong with red? All right, all right, all right, go. All right, shut it off. Shut it off. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. For taking those silly glasses off. It's not sunny out. <laughs> all right, where are we going now? Traffic. There's nothing <laughs> wrong with my glasses. We're going to uh, we're going to my sister's house. The release party was a couple nights ago. You know, she got the book, and we went. Uh, my brother and I, Dan, we're going to see if she read the book and how she liked it. You know, I want to know. I need some feedback. You really think she read it already? Yeah, and I think she likes my red glasses better than you do. <laughs> Horrible. <laughs> All right. Uh, so here we are at my sister's house in Newton. Is that where we are, Newton? She's Newtonville, Newton, Newton, something. I don't know. Um, yeah. So. Just gonna sort of surprise her, see if she read the book yet, and ask her what she thinks. You sure she's here? Uh, her car's here, is it? Uh, I have no idea. She's here. She does work a lot. It's the hell? The weekend. Call her. Where the hell is she? The landlord ladies and I'll probably freak her out. Oh, I think I hear. Yeah. Huh? What are you doing? Surprise. No, we're just doing a film. We're uh, for a little sleep. You know, we're gonna put it like on YouTube and all that stuff. What? Um, Why so, did you, you did you read the book yet? You know, I've been working for two days. Oh. Come on, you're making me look bad. Sorry. Why are you filming? Stop. Uh, sorry, uh... I couldn't... I couldn't have time to read it. You don't do this on anything. Sorry, right. Got it. Nice feet. <laughs> Alright, here I am with my younger brother. Fabulous brother, Dan Tremblay. He's been doing a lot of the filming recently for me. And uh, I'm gonna ask him a few questions. So, first off, Dan. Um, what is your favorite book of all time? Oh, man. It doesn't have to be that one, clearly, but... Uh, besides a little sleep? Besides a little sleep. Uh, Favorite book of all time. That's a tough one. <laughs> you gotta what what comes to mind? <laughs> what uh, comes to mind? Uh, all right, doesn't have to be favorite. Just if someone were to ask, or you give me a. You know, I love The Lord of the Rings. Okay. I love The Stand mm -hmm. by Stephen King. Never heard of him. Uh, <laughs> favorite freaking book. Dead Zone, I love by Stephen King. I, I like a lot of horror books. Okay. Clive Barker, Stephen King. Well, that segues well into my next question is, what's your favorite horror movie of all time? There's another one. Where you, you get a half hour? <laughs> uh, I'll give you a few. The Thing. The Thing. Evil, Evil Dead 2. Uh-huh. Uh, That's good. All right. Exorcist. Mm -hmm. <laughs> all right. One little sleep question for you. Would you hang out with Mark Janovich, the star private detective of Little Sleep? Funny story is that I didn't. No. Uh, <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Would I hang out with Mark Jenovich? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I don't know if I could handle his uh, narcolepsy. It sounds like it would be. So, if any of your friends have like disease or something bad, you're just going to ditch him? What if he's. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. Oh boy, uncomfortable. He seems like a funny, witty guy. You know, right. he's, you know, he's got good humor. That's what I was looking for. He smokes too much, though. No, I'm yeah, no, he does. Uh, all right. Now, without swearing, Please tell me why you like to swear a lot. Because I'm a true Bulgarian. Okay. It's, it's only words. And I know words are powerful. But people get offended way too easily. And I think it's a craft that I have. I'm a true Bulgarian. A true Bulgarian. And this is very hard for me not to swear. I know that. Thank you. <laughs> um, 
Now, is that a box of nuts in front of you or a box of legumes? Legumes? Excuse me, it's not personal. No, uh, legumes? No, peanuts are legumes. This is, uh, these are nuts. All right. Actually, I think they're fake. Okay. Um, <laughs> and why do you live next to a giant rabbit? I don't know. It's the first time I saw it. Buddy Zilla, it scared me. It's the first time know. you saw it today? They're weird. My neighbors are weird. So, yeah, don't um, they like, they, they build like, they build like chicken catapults, don't they? No, pumpkin catapults. Oh, pumpkin catapults. I guess chicken catapults would be bad. Yeah. Oh man, now they're gonna see this and hate me. Not that they don't already hate me. Oh uh, yes. Loud, Bulgarian ways. <laughs> Yes, because millions of people are going to see this video. <laughs> well, thanks, Dan. I'm sure we'll be seeing you in future videos. Say goodbye. Bye. Hey, hi. I'm here with uh, my great sister, Erin. Um, you saw her on film a little while ago. She's much more calm now. We'd be better. Uh, I don't know. Coffee? Something's <laughs> covered down. All right. All right. Just a few questions for you. Um, have you ever had a patient like Mark Janovich? She's a nurse. Have I ever had a patient? I've never had a patient with narcolepsy. Okay. But I can say I've had patients with a character like him, yeah. perhaps. Um, a little vulgar, some, you know, <laughs> smoker. We have a lot of smokers. Mm. Uh, but no one with narcolepsy. All right. Now, I've heard that you are really good at karaoke. Is oh, that, is no. that true? <laughs> <laughs> I like to think I am, but uh -huh. some people tell me I'm not. Oh, who told you you're not good at karaoke? <laughs> Steven. Oh, boy. I do love it. You do, I know. <laughs> and, all right, lastly, since you were there at the release party that we had after the Boston Public Library event. What uh, a blast. Thursday, that was a lot of fun. Great time. Uh, can you name the three, the top three stars of the release party? <laughs> without going into too many glory details. Uh, it would have to be my mother, my Aunt Mary. Um, who would be the third? No, those two are, are definitely colorful. Definitely number in one. Their behavior. Two. Um, could Dre? be Dre or Dre's girlfriend for uh, the two of them together. Two of them together. They make a good team. <laughs> right, and how heavy was this thing? Bonus question. <laughs> I wouldn't knock it. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know. Steve picked it up. He's a de decorator of the house. <laughs> and he does a very fine job. He does. All right. Thanks, Aaron. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs>